Hello everyone, Richard here again and I'm back with another tutorial. In today's video, you will learn how to align images alongside paragraphs in your WordPress post using a Gutenberg editor. So with that said, let's jump into our tutorial. Okay, I am now at the back end of my uh, WordPress uh, subdomain. So first of all, what we want to do is to uh, check some sample posts in here just like what I do in here, this one okay this is what we will be uh, creating later okay because sometimes th this kind of way of creating post is sometimes mostly forgotten though it's easy okay so let's head over back to my dashboard and I will be adding new post for the sake of this example and we will be naming our post as sample post slash or dash sample demo so for the sake of this example um, I'm just putting a title like this okay since this is not my main website so for um, to make this tutorial fast I will be or we will be generating sample paragraphs as well okay so I have opened up a uh, lipsum generator this is normally a sample text so let's say I am going to generate six paragraphs for the sake of this example and I'm going to click on generate okay here we go I will need to copy this six paragraph and I'll post it in here okay here we go normally uh, what we do when we add um, when we add images to our WordPress post is we, we do something like this we will be um, actually I'm using Gutenberg editor right now so normally well, every time that we add new image to our WordPress post we will be uh, we are normally doing something like this we will be just adding new blocks like this one image and then we choose image and then we upload or search for for the type of image that we want to post on our post in our media library just like what I'm doing right now just like this one but however there is no way that you can make this float alongside your paragraph okay let's say for example I'm going to drag this one um, beside this paragraph above so I cannot do that I cannot drag this one in, in here it's not possible okay so what we will be doing is not something like this but let's say for example I want to add let's say this is the one that I am going to add images beside it okay so it's not possible to do that if you are using this kind of block okay so you need to copy this block in here I'm sorry you need to um, this is where we are at right now this is the one that we want to add image beside it so the only thing that we can do to uh, add image in here on the right side is to copy this one and then remove this block and change it because actually uh, let me repeat again what I did let's say for example if we are going to change this block into something like what we look for it's not possible it's not available in here so we need to copy this one once it once the text are copied then we need to remove this block and then we will be adding new block okay so click this plus icon so that we can add new block okay or you can just let's say you can just click enter so that you can add new block and the shortcut way of adding new block is to type in slash and then find the kind of block that you want to add for the sake of this tutorial so that we will be able to add images alongside our paragraph we need to use the classic this is the classic block so click on that here we go so paste again the text that we have copied earlier and here we go so for us to be able to add an item in here which is an image we need first to click here so that or we can just click in here and then press enter and then here we go we can now add new image you need to click this one for you to be able to add media or images that is from your WordPress library or you can just upload new image here we go 
let's say this is the one that I want to add this cactus I will click this one and insert it into our post here we go we want this to be floating or to be uh, to be alongside this paragraph so I am going to uh, place this on the left alignment here we go so that's it that's how easy it is if you want it to be aligned on the right side you can just choose this one or you can choose center but uh, for the sake of this tutorial we will be using this one align left so that it will float on the left side alongside with a paragraph on the left side okay on the right side I mean let's click save or publish so that we can see the change that we have made okay let's view our post and here we go this is the one that I am talking about but if you are not satisfied with the size of the image you can just resize the image by dragging it in here okay you can just drag it out so that you can maximize the size of the image just like what I'm doing so if this is enough for you then click on publish again or update and once it's updated then refresh your post and here we go here we go and if you want to add another image on the rest of the paragraph in here you can just do it so by doing the same thing that I did earlier you can just click this one or copy this let's say if this is the one that you want to add another image then copy this one and then remove again the block and after that click enter or press enter on your keyboard and here we go you can add new blocks by clicking the icon in here or just by means of typing in slash here we go so choose classic again and paste the text that you have copied and here we go click again in here and then press enter so that you can add new elements or new image so this is the uh, icon that we will use to add new image so click on it and search for the image that you want to add let's say this is the one that I'm going to add, or this one okay that's it that's how easy it is for you to do it okay you can align this to the to the right or to the left if you want to uh, right now we, we will need to align this to the right because earlier this one is aligned to the left while this second one will be aligned to the to the right here we go and I will be stretching it out I will be maximizing again or resizing the image and here we go it's done already I will be updating my post right now so that we can see the result here we go I'm refreshing my post again and here we go here is the image that we have just added so that's how easy it is for you to add new image or images alongside its paragraph so I think that's all there is to it for today's tutorial. If you found this video helpful, please give us a like, subscribe, and share this with others. That's all for now. Thanks for watching and see you on my next video.